Welcome to myprojectbazaar.com. Let me discuss about the process, safe similarity analysis by self-tuning, locally constrained mixer diffusion. Let me see about the process, safe similarity analysis by self-tuning, locally constrained mixer diffusion. In this process, initially, the similarity, similarity between the shapes were analyzed and the similar shapes were retained. Here, for uh, analyzing the similarity shapes, we employ the feature extraction algorithms such as shift and the GLCM algorithms. The shift algorithm extracts the uh, edge based information from the image, and the GLCM algorithm extracts the uh, gray level based values from the images. So, these values were saved as features and they are passed into the support vector machine classifier. The support vector machine classifier classifies the images based on the features extracted and the two label setup. So, the trained images will give the exact correct answers. And after that, um, the equivalent distance is measured between the test image and the trained features. And the images that were having the low gradient distances were taken and they were retrieved from the database. So these contain mostly similar images which is color, which represents the input, and input image. So uh, thus uh, we are producing a retrieval system that is mostly correct or most correctly the shape similar shapes from the database. There may be also some misclassifications and uh, misretrieval of the images. Um, if you see the flow of the process, safe similarity analysis by self-tuning locally constrained mixer diffusion. Initially, the test image is taken and it is pre-processed. In pre-processing, we apply median filter. Median filter is used to remove the noises from the input images. It is often desirable to perform some kind of noise reduction in on an input image. Median filter is a non-linear digital filtering technique often used to remove noise. Such noise reduction technique is a typical pre-processing step used to improve the results in the later processing. Median filtering is very widely used in digital image processing. After pre-processing, we are extracting the features from the input images. In order to extract features from the images, we use shift and the zero-zero algorithms. Shift features were extracted from the input images. This shift features um, shows us the uh, the shift features show gives us the edge information of the input image. The input image uh, may contain some uh, the needed in the visible, clearly visible edges were extracted from the shift features and then the GLCM features extra are gives the texture based information related to the image. So the GLCM uh, features shows us the grayscale uh, changes in the input images and which describes the uh, which describes the in processing which describes the grayscale values within the image. And these features were extracted and then they are saved. Uh, the same procedure is, is, is used in the training images. So all the for all the training images, features were extracted, and then they are passed into the classifier. So for classification, we are using a support vector machine. So the support vector machine classifies the input sim, uh, input uh, shape into uh, the corresponding shape depending on the trained images, and then uh, using the equivalent distance, the we the features extracted. The, minimum, uh, the objects having the minimum distance were extracted from the uh, data set and the value on the similar images were retrieved. We will discuss the execution of the process, safe similarity analysis by self-tuning locally constrained mixer diffusion. If you want to run the code, select the file m.main.m which is located in the source code folder. Right click it and click on the run file, we will get the guide window. This guide window contains all the user interfaces needed in order to run the code. Uh, first select the training data, uh, browse your system and select the folder training set which is presented in the source code folder and click OK. Now all the images in the training set folder were feature extracted and the results were displayed here. Now the features are extracted for all the images and then uh, select a query image which is presented in the test set. So we will apply the processing then features were extracted for the image. Then after uh, feature extraction, uh, we apply the classification. So this image is classified as apple, and then similar shapes were retrieved from the dataset. 
sure some of the images were wrongly retrieved and also there will be some misclassifications by classification also so finally we are uh, identifying the input shape and uh, classify it and uh, we are retrieving the similar shapes from the data set for that uh, we are using the same and uh, shift feature completely uh, the, uh, they are passed into the classifier and the uh, uh, shape data for classification we are using train and classifier and uh, for classification we are using svm classifier and uh, finally we are retrieving similar images thank you